All right, what is going on, everyone? Thank you all so much for stopping by the Card Dojo. My name is Sean, and this is my journey into modern day card collecting. Well, guys, it is Wednesday, and as you know, we like to wing it. Today is no different. I was gonna do a mixer, but then I remembered I had this little box of Heritage Baseball 2021, and figured, you know, let's let's do the baseball. Let's do the baseball. It is baseball season. I am trying to get more into baseball this year as the Yankees um, keep losing games. But, you know, that's okay. I'm paying attention. I'm getting there. And I've never ripped Heritage in my short little channel history. So let's do it, guys. Let's do it. In this box, we will have 72 cards. Um, we can possibly find candy lids. We could possibly find maybe an auto or a relic. But uh, I'm not really sure the odds. I have seen a hobby box ripped by a Haas of cards and he got a mem card. So I would imagine if mem cards are popping out of um, hobby boxes, autos are pretty hard to catch. But, you know, we're going to try anyway, guys. We have been pretty lucky with the baseball rips. So hopefully in this unique old school looking product, uh, maybe we can catch one. Maybe we'll catch one. We will see. Um, they do look like two cool cards to do TTM which is through the mail, another Haas specialty that I am slacking on and I am not, have never done. But these cards would look cool with a little ink, so maybe I could possibly do that once we get um, some more knowledge of how to do that. So guys, here we go. This is ALRBI leader, <laughs> leaders, um, Jose Abreu, Luke Boyt, Jose Ramirez, and Mike Trout, so that's pretty cool. Um, here we have Spencer Hayward in action. We got Alec Bohm in action, the rookie. I know he is someone who, to, who we should be keeping our eye on, so we will put that down, guys. Already a pretty good rookie hit. However, I didn't put him in the best spot. There we go. Okay, we have Randall um, Grichuk. Again, guys, I'm not really good at pronouncing the names of these players, so I do apologize for that. We have rookie stars from Phillies, Spencer Howard and Alec Bohm. Once again, guys, Bohm is showing up. He's showing up. Okay. Gregory Polanco. We got um, George Polanco. Are they brothers? They don't... They might be? Maybe not. I don't know. Okay. We have Framber Valdez and a Chad Cool. That is a cool way of spelling cool. Okay. Maybe I'll use that. K-U-H-L Cool. Okay. Here we go. Uh, no, I'm sorry. I saw pinstripes and got excited. It is not the Yankees. It is the Rockies. Garrett Hampson. Uh, he is... No, okay. And again, not a rookie. He's a Rocky. <laughs> All right. We're, we're making progress here. Uh, Justin Verlander in action. So we have a little in action pile. 2020 ALERA leaders for Shane Bieber, Dallas Kuchel, and Chris Bassett. Um, another one of these cool little multi-people leader things. All right. Keston Hira in action. We got Alex Cobb for the Orioles. We got Robbie Grossman for the Athletics. Something just fell there. Yes, guys, we have a little, <clears throat> excuse me, um, a little, I have no idea. Is this the uh, candy lid? I don't know. It is Rod Carew, twin, second baseman, and it's a little uh, Baseball Stars bubble gum. Um, 25 of 25. I don't think that's numbering. I'm thinking this may be like just 25 different pictures. I would imagine. I don't think this is a super short print. Oh, uh, strange. Very strange little thing here. Can we even make that work? Um, kinda. I have no idea what to do with that, guys. All right, moving right along. Robbie Grossman, did we pull him already? Maybe. Uh, Jeff McNeil for the Mets and a uh, Brian Anderson for the Marlins. For the Marlins. So we're moving on, guys, to the next pack. How many cards per pack is this? And how many packs? I don't know. I know 72 cards total, so at least I did pay attention to something. Mike, and this name I struggle with, Yas, Yastrum, Yas, Yastrzemski, Yastrzemski. Nailed it. Probably wrong. In action, we got a Kenta Medea for the Twins. We got NL postseason 2020. Tatis's two home runs secure the win. That's pretty cool. I know there are short prints here as well. And maybe toward the end, I believe, if what I've heard from Hossa Cards, I think it was 400 or higher. I'm not going to drive you all crazy looking at that now, but I will go through and maybe we'll do a recap. So there we go, guys, for the Yankees PC. We got Garrett Cole. We'll put him over here on the other end. Socially distanced from the other hits. 
We got Joe Adele. That's a rookie. New Age Performers. Put him there. Put him right there. Ronald Guzman for the Rangers. And then we got a Josh Bell for the Pittsburgh Pirates. Moving on to the next pack. I'm liking this so far. This is pretty cool. Definitely, definitely a different style than, you know, the shiny super prisms that we're used to seeing. Uh, we have a Danny Duffy. Uh, Max Scherzer in action. We got, uh, for the Yankees, we got Thario Estrada. Thario Estrada. I'm not really, honestly, too familiar. I am trying to pay more attention. It's hard. I can't stream games while at work. Um, it's, it's, an, it's an issue that I'm trying to work on. Maybe by getting an app from, like, a different country that allows me to do things. Here we have a Lou Bob in action. I've always done well pulling Lou Bobs. Here we have Randy Dobnak. Uh, Joey Wendell for the Rays. We got Colton Brewer for the Red Sox. That doesn't look like uh, the proper colors for Red Sox. That might be a short print, so it is higher than the numbers there. So that could be a short print of Colton Brewer. We'll put him over there for the uh, pile. DJ LeMahieu, the uh, catcher, I believe, right? Is he the catcher for the Yankees? Oh, uh, no, he's third baseman. Wait, no, I'm, I'm, I'm not paying attention, guys. I'm, I'm rushing. I'm horrible second baseman. I don't know why I always get him confused. I don't know why I always get him and the catcher confused. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do better, though. I'm gonna do better. Here we have Angels for Julio. Terran, Terran, possibly, possibly not. Okay, we are down, guys, to just four packs. And we did not get an auto or a mem card. So are we disappointed? Not really, because we, we know what we're getting into. We have a Trey Turner for the Nationals. In action, we got Brandon Love. Looks like he just threw out a Yankee, maybe turning a double play here, unfortunately for us. Not bad, though. Not a bad car. Kyle Schwaber for the Cubs. Another one of these double cards. We got 2021 Rookie Stars, Cardinals, Cody Whitley and Raul Ramirez. I'm not quite sure of either of those gentlemen. This is different. This is a Rookie of the Year award for Jackie Robinson. So it's simply a picture of a statue or a plaque that he got. So interesting, Rookie of the Year award. You don't actually get a picture of Jackie Robinson, but you get his reward, okay? Uh, J.D. Davis, Devin Williams, all-star rookie for the Brewers. We got Howie Kendrick for the Nationals, and then a Adam Wright for the, the Cardinals. For the Cardinals, okay. I would like to get another Yankee hit, and I would like to get an autograph. Is that asking for too much out of your heritage? For your first appearance here at the dojo, as my voice cracks and I can't talk. Um, this is in action for Nolan Arenado. We have... Jerickson Profar, possibly. I possibly butchered that name as well. Um, we have boyhood photos of the stars. Jesus Lazardo, way back in the day, playing a little Little League. Pretty cool. I don't think he's old enough to really be in black and white, but they do that just to, for the effect. Uh, here we have a Bo Bichette. We got Clayton Kershaw for the Dodgers. We got Danny Jansen for the Blue Jays. We got Cody Bellinger for the Dodgers. And here's another one of the threes, uh, 2021 Astros uh, rookie stars for Illinois uh, Paradise, Blake Taylor, and Taylor Jones. There you go. I do like how they isolate the pictures, almost like a rated rookie style, um, but you know, just more old school. And it's top, so it's not a rated rookie. All right, guys, we are down to two packs. Two packs, I think we've done pretty good. I would like to find another rookie. Have I been completely slacking? on the rookies or have I just not been noticing them? So here's a Hunter Dozier, another dual card for um, rookie stars for the Dodgers. We have um, Kybert Ruiz and Mitch White, maybe, possibly. Here we have Michael Chavez for the Red Sox. Why are the Red Sox all... Now see, I thought maybe the, the coloring of the Red Sox is what cued me up. So that was a short print, but then as it turns out, um, I was wrong. So I'm not sure why that's a short print. I will find out. Here's a picture of a guy on the sidewalk. They couldn't even get him in the stadium. He's just awkwardly like on the grass portion of the sidewalk. Uh, okay. There you go for the Red Sox rivals. Here we have 2020 World Series game one. And that is Betts. Is that Mookie? I'm not really sure. They kind of don't really show his name. I'm assuming that's Mookie. I could be wrong. Here's Charlie Blackman for the Rockies. We have then and now for Dick Allen and Luke Voigt. So I'm not sure what was then and I'm not sure what's going on now. But it is then and now. And there you go. 
Uh, I guess he, they were the uh, home run. AL home run leaders. So maybe they could have denoted that on the front, but we we did our investigation, guys, and we we, did, we figured it out. We figured it out. Here is Lance McCullers Jr., Yandy Diaz, and finally, ooh, another one, uh, AL pitching leaders for Shane Bieber, Garrett Cole, and Marco Gonzalez. So we do get a Yankee front and center, even though he's not focused. Pretty good, pretty good. And just like that, guys, 72 cards down to the very last pack. There are nine, nine cards per pack. So there you go for the math majors out there who can actually divide 72 and nine. Here we have Miguel Rojas, Whit Merrifield, another one of the boyhood, boyhood photos of the stars. Very young dude here, probably playing softball, maybe a little t-ball, little um, soft, like the little soft, squishy baseballs I used to play with when we were a kid. This way you didn't, you know, hurt each other when you're like, you know, five years old. Sterling Mart in action. We got 2020 NL ERA leaders for Trevor Bauer, Hugh Darvish, and Denilson Lamont. I'm not sure if that last guy's name was correct, but we tried. Uh, Rio Ruiz. We got Wilson Contreras. We got Shohei Atani, who I know has been picking up some, uh, picking up some steam. Doing pretty well with his uh, pitching and batting, I do believe. I do believe, but I could absolutely be wrong. Um, yeah, pitcher and designated hitter. Great on both sides of the plate. And guys, finally, we have a Kevin Pillar. So unless I completely struck out on the rookies, the first pack was the rookie pack, and then the rest was just kind of like nonsense. So I'm going to go through these to see if I can find, if I miss any rookies, or if I miss any like short prints or something. I'll be right back. Alright guys, in that little split second pause for you, I did a little crash course on uh, how this product works and the parallels and I need Sherlock Holmes and like CSI to help me determine the parallels and the uh, alternates and all that kind of stuff guys. But we did catch, I guess, three short prints, so we'll take a look at them, them right now. Um, the, the Jorge Polanco was a short print, I don't know why. Uh, this one was as well with this guy just hanging out like outside of the practice field as well as the guy on the sidewalk So yeah, those were the short prints um, Yeah, there's also like no stars. There's French ones. There's things that have like words here I didn't really see any so I don't think we caught anything other than these three We did open a blaster so to be expected um, No other rookie cards in fact no actual rookie cards because this is an insert and I believe this one is too. So we didn't get any base rookie cards. So getting the Alec Bohm, I guess, was pretty good considering you're not getting many rookies. So yeah, there you go. All right, guys, this is fun. Like I said, I would love to maybe go to Yankee Stadium and get these guys to sign these cards or something. Maybe do a little TTM action, take a course from uh, Hasa Cards and uh, see if I can't get these guys. These are more modern players, so probably harder to do than the old school dudes, but you know, maybe I'll give it a shot. We will see. All right, guys, tomorrow is Pokemon. Friday is the boom box. So we'll see you then. But for now, and as always, thank you so much for stopping by and take care.